we are into the heart of the 2022 Atlantic hurricane season with our busiest months for storms upon us. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, or NOAA, has released an update to their forecast on what to expect this year in the tropics. Two major drivers of any hurricane season are the activity era that you're in, which is really the sea surface temperature, and then also factor in whether you're likely to be in an El Nino or a La Nina. The La Nina pattern combined with above average sea surface temperatures and lack of wind shear will contribute to storm development and growth. NOAA is still calling for an above average season, but has decreased their number of forecasted named storms slightly to 14 to 20, down from 21. There have been no changes to the number of hurricanes expected, six to 10. NOAA expects three to five of those hurricanes could escalate into major status, meaning category three, four, or five on the Saffir Simpson scale. This is a slight decrease from NOAA's original outlook issued in May, but still an above average season forecast. Climatologically, 2022 has been on track with three named storms. Alex, Bonnie, and Colin all before August 3rd. 90% of hurricanes historically occur after August 1st in the Atlantic Basin. The peak of hurricane season is early September, and regardless of the forecast, the real message is preparedness. Any one of those 14 and 20 can devastate a community, so you may not have the time to prepare later, so prepare now. Keep in mind, these forecasts do not include possible land impacts, so it is essential to know your risk and have a plan in place. For Weather Nation, I'm meteorologist Lucy Bergman.